Hey guys, welcome to my newest video for today, Christmas Eve. Um, I sound and look like shit. <laughs> I woke up okay and then like 20 minutes later, full-blown allergy attack and I'm still suffering from it. But I pulled out all my DVDs and Blu-rays that I bought and I was planning to do the video, which I'm doing, um, because I realized I hadn't done any weekly hauls. And I basically had let the collection build, which I didn't want to do. But I wanted to get this video up, even with how terrible I sound, terrible I look. I mean, even though I showered, my hair is a mess, so that's why I'm rocking out my Night of the Demons hat from Frightcrete. So I am just going to get started. Uh, first batch were November's uh, whore pack. I still haven't gotten the December one. I'm probably not going to get it till at least between Wednesday and Friday. So there was uh, Cell 213. Oh, excuse me. He told you I'm off my game today. <laughs> Dead Within. Found. And <laughs> Lake Placid vs. Anaconda. I can't believe about that movie. And then the Blu-ray packs had... The Barber, Bitter Feast, which was the horror pack limited edition, and Maggie. The other one that was in the pack was um, Would You Rather, which I owned. Um, these two came from Amazon because nobody advertised this was coming out, and usually I'm on the ball with this particular show, and from what I hear, nobody knew this was actually out on Blu-ray, so I got it, and that is the complete tenth series or the god knows how many series of Doctor Who which I finished yesterday so now I'm all caught up I'm not ready for tomorrow I'm not ready for Peter Cabalti to leave and the other movie I got was Dracula with uh, Frank Langella I've never seen this uh got this one on eBay because I have the sequel so I might as well get the first one and that is uh Heavy Metal which I've never seen then got this from Scream Factory. I've been eyeing it off and on, and I was like, oh, screw it, I'm going to get it. And it's the complete series of the cartoon Beetlejuice. Then this, I've been putting it off, putting it off, because it is a very expensive DVD, because it's very out of print. But one guy on eBay selling it for about $50, which is about $50 less than what usually it's going for. And uh, I grabbed a Muppet Family Christmas only to turn it on and then realize some stuff was edited out. Not happy about that. It's not the not the guy's fault, but um, he should have uh, it should have had a thing saying some of the songs were taken out. I wasn't happy about that. So my USB one is still staying around. Then pre-ordered this from uh, Scream Factory because I actually liked the first one and Jeffrey Combs is voicing a character in this. Kind of appropriate. And that is uh, Howard Lovecraft and the Undersea Kingdom. Haven't watched this yet. Then went to Best Buy because I don't trust Walmart to have anything I want. I say that and then they had some of the things I want. So I went to Best Buy and I got, and I haven't even taken it out of the packaging yet. Uh, gay, the, 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 the season 7 of Game of Thrones and I also picked up Kingsman the Golden Circle I was eyeing the steelbook for um, Game of Thrones but for me I'm a really stickler for steelbooks I'd rather have the complete set instead of just one Like I say that and I did it for um, Walking Dead thinking I'd get season five six and seven on steelbook but they were always sold out so then got this on ebay um got the season 12 of criminal minds little story i had ordered this on amazon through on black friday and for some reason eight days later it hasn't hadn't shipped so because it was 19.99 so i was like you know fuck this i canceled it went on ebay i only had to pay five dollars more but at least i got it i got it like a week after i bought it so i went to one walmart 
and I was so shocked they had it. I haven't watched it yet because I'm actually all Christmas out. Um, I've tried watching a few of the Christmas movies I own. Um, I've actually watched quite a few, but I think I've only watched one or two blind buys and not the ones I wanted. And this was one of them I wanted to watch. Better watch out. And the others, like, I might get a Christmas Horror Story watch today, depending on how I feel. Uh, but, like, uh, two of the others I bought, and, like, uh, Miracle on 34th Street, and a couple others I didn't get to watch. I'm so mad I haven't watched the uh, Polar Express, so. <sighs> and then, this was on sale, like, I know it wasn't um widely received very well but I was like ah oh, screw it I might like it um it was like 15.99 and that's the uh, King Arthur Legend of the Sword that was at one Walmart we went to and then we went to our Walmart here in Langley and I found it's a Muppet Christmas movie <laughs> 10 bucks in the bin so and another case of so shocked they actually got it, though I know everybody seems to hate this movie. I haven't watched it yet. Um, and that is Leatherface. I was actually quite shocked Walmart got this. So, and then my mom and I went out and went to a couple of the uh, used uh, thrift stores here. And I found uh, at the one a bunch of Blu-rays. So, the first one... I've never seen this. How have I never seen a Robin Williams movie, especially one of his most popular? That is Jumanji, which was 10 bucks. See, I can't believe I haven't watched that. And then I got The Peacemaker, which uh, hasn't even been out. Uh, it uh, came like this, and see, $6. And then I've seen that one. I got to see that in the theater. And then I found Perfect Getaway, like seven dollars and Scrooged for eight I figured I might I'm not the biggest fan of Bill Murray I've only liked the two Ghostbusters and Groundhog Day that was really it but I am also a huge fan of Richard Donner so I am gonna get that and I didn't realize he had directed Scrooged so, then we went to another one and I bought four I got home and realized the DVD I bought I had on Blu-ray, but in one of those like four film sets, so that's always for me hard to keep track of. And it was a Dracula Christopher Lee movie, so I was like, "Well, mom, you got a DVD here." <laughs> so, uh, but because I got, f I spent over a certain amount of money, I was able to pick out one for free. The one I picked out for free is out on Blu-ray, but I figured free, why not? Coyote Ugly, which I have seen. I got to see this in the theater back in 2000. And then the other one, I looked around because um, one of my usual sellers on eBay has it, but for $12 and used it was seven. Gods and Monsters, which I've, I've wanted to see for a couple of years now. And then the uh, last one I picked up from this place was King Arthur. I actually like this movie. No, not a lot of people did, but I quite enjoyed it. And plus, it was only six eighty five, so I was like, "Wow, I'll take it." So, and then the last one for this huge haul, luckily I didn't take forever, was uh, at Dollarama. It's a movie called Face Off. It's a hockey movie, obviously, <laughs> but it's a Canadian hockey movie. And uh, I realized the guy in this is actually the guy from Black Christmas, the guy with the huge fur coat. For like three bucks so I was like screw it so yeah guys that is it that's all I've gotten since my last haul video I I didn't mean to let it go for so long but it unfortunately happened um but uh, yeah tell me what you guys think what you like I think I'm particularly I know a lot of people have hated this but let me know what you guys here thought about it I particularly um better watch out um i was so mad i didn't get to do that watch that one for my christmas but i mean i got to a point where i'm just sick sick of all this christmas shit <laughs> i know that sounds bad but when your place of employment decides to play the fucking christmas music the day after remembrance day there's a huge fucking problem 
Um, I can stand Frank Sinatra and Dean Martin singing Christmas music. I'm cool with that. But anything like the itchy and scratchy, I saw Mommy's Kiss and Santa Claus, I'm done. <laughs> so... So yeah, guys, aside from that rant, I think I'm just so fucking tired right now with my allergies. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I don't know when my next one will be because, like, tomorrow's Christmas, duh. And then I don't think you guys in the U.S. have Boxing Day, but uh, us up here in Canada do. It's kind of like Black Friday, so I think you guys should have a Boxing Day, but then it would just probably just be as bad as Black Friday. But I haven't seen any sales for that, so I don't know. Cause I'm I'm I am actually looking to buy an a, a, an actual uh, camcorder for my YouTube videos, but uh, they're a, still a little more pricey than I want to spend right now. I'm not cheap. <laughs> it's just three hundred dollars for something I might use only three four times a month. I don't I don't know. It's been up in the air thinking about that. So. But yeah, we won't get any mail because I know I'm still waiting on my horror packs, uh, which I've heard good and pretty bad things about this month. I don't know what's in them because I'm actually not watching any videos. Um, my horror bam box got shipped. Um, my Krampus creeper crate got shipped. And I'm just waiting for a couple others. <sighs> oh, excuse me. So yeah, I might have a... Um, a video up later in the week I might not I don't know but on that note I hope all of you because I'm not gonna even be on the internet tomorrow because um, I'm usually on Twitter Instagram my Facebook page or what have you I'm not gonna be on tomorrow because obviously Christmas even though it's only gonna be my parents myself and my uncle Jimmy which you know what well we'll take <laughs> because we want kind of a quiet Christmas so I hope you all have a Merry Christmas and and I don't know what else. <laughs> uh, yeah, have a have a Merry Christmas, I guess. <laughs> That's what allergy medicine does to me. So until my next video, guys, I hope you all have a good day. Have a great Christmas. Maybe not watch a shitload of movies. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. And until the next video, guys, I should oh, see I screwed up on that, but I'm not going to do it again. <laughs> Merry Christmas, guys. <laughs> I'll catch you later in the next video. Bye. Sorry about the flubs. <laughs>